Hey guys, Will here with NVIDIA. We're here at HTC's press conference at Mobile World Congress 2012 taking a look at the just announced HTC One X powered by the Tegra 3 processor, the world's only 4 plus 1 quad-core mobile processor. Let's take a quick look at what this guy's got. We're, we're looking at a 4.7 inch Super LCD 2 display, super bright. It has full 720p resolution, that's 1280 by 720. Uh, you can see that it's using Sense 4, the latest version of Sense from HTC, fully customized version of Android Ice Cream Sandwich here. Um, it's got a new cool camera UI, and what you'll notice immediately is that you got a camera shutter and a video uh, shutter here, so you can take pictures. While you're recording video, you can actually snap photos simultaneously, you're recording full HD video and taking super high resolution photos at the same time. If I wanted, I could actually go into continuous shooting burst mode. I don't know if you can make out the clicks, but it's taking a lot of frames per second. Well, another cool feature is actually on the hardware. You'll notice that it's a matte white body, and that's actually a polycarbonate, a seamless polycarbonate unibody that's got micro holes drilled in it. That adds stability, it adds structural integrity, reduces vibration, makes it super strong. And if you'll notice on the side, I don't know if you can pick it up there, but the glass is raised up from the bezel here, giving it kind of a raised, curved feel to it. It feels amazing when you just rub your hand over it. And rounding out the hardware, we have a 1.3 megapixel camera on the front, an 8 megapixel camera on the back, and the cool thing about this back camera is it's actually got an f2.0 lens. That's a really, really, really fast lens that uh, allows more light, and the image sensor has larger pixels to let in more light for better low-light performance. All powered by Tegra 3, the world's only 4 plus 1 wide-core mobile processor.